takeoff. No, don't answer me. That's nice. There is one thing to know about the flaps, uh, because I couldn't find any flaps lever to put it into landing or takeoff position. So uh, I guess they are uh, managed by the flight computer, so we don't have to care about them at all. Second thing to know is, uh, when we rotate about a, at about 120 knots, we're gonna pull this line up to the horizon. And once we have it there, we're just gonna keep it there until the wheels are off the ground. Softly. We're gonna keep this line at the horizon until the feet are off the ground and until you can take your gear up. Alright, next thing we do is we turn on our radar. This is our radar screen. Right now we see that the radar is turned off. We can turn it on by turning this knob until it's in the EM position. Now we can see the radar screen is up and running, it's searching left, right, left, right. We can put it in a straight mode by pressing this button. It will now be a square screen, not like the turned one we saw before. Also here we can increase and decrease uh, the height and the width 
of the radar scan zone and here we can increase or decrease the distance of the radar screen. Next thing we do is we turn on our uh, master arm. This will arm all our weapons. Um, as you can see we have loaded uh, the Super 530 and the Magic 2 missile. If you want to use the Super 530 missile, you're going to press this button and it will give you the little S. Also the head-up display will change and you will get the big circle and the little lock circle for the circle. So if you lock something on the target. Same for the Magic 2 missile, if you choose it, you get the little S. Also 